show you very quickly the beauty of the ruins in Bacolod. It's the ancestral mansion home. It's, it's actually the remains of the ancestral mansion home of Don Mariano Ledesma Laxon and Maria Braga Laxon. It's in Talisay City, which is just right at the border of Bacolod City and Talisay's uh, central park. to visit another family so all your time actually back home is just spent with family and the meals together so we're here we're visiting our my uncle Eddie hi 
It's kids day today. We're actually supposed to have lunch at Jake's, but when Filipinos, and especially kids, when they see Jollibee, there would never be anything else but just Jollibee. No other choice, Jollibee, Jollibee. Jollibee is like the McDonald's in the Philippines, a local brand. But in the Philippines, it's Jollibee's way, not McDonald's. So when kids really would, would be asked to choose between McDonald's and Jollibee, it's always Jollibee, nothing else. Right, Ella? <laughs> Say something on the vlog, Ella. You're watching my vlog, my gosh, she's always watching my vlog. And now it's her time to speak on the vlog. Say hi, la. Say hi, Deros. Hi. 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 Say hi, say hi. 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 Ah, hindi mo galing shy. There's something about Jollibee that kids are addicted to. And when kids are at Jollibee, they only order one. He ordered one. Chicken joy. <laughs> It's one piece chicken. They would never trade it for anything. It has any restaurant at all. It's chicken joy. See? Everyone ordered chicken joy. Tally hot dog is good. I think this is the only different meal you ordered. <laughs> and then mine, that's a jolly hot dog. This is the burger steak uh, super meal. Also, another thing with Filipinos is that, like yesterday, I've never had a chance to have rice. And I feel like I'm weak now, so I, I have to have a load of rice in my tummy <laughs> so I can recharge. You can't live a day without rice, right? Yes. <laughs> At least twice a day. For me, when I started living abroad, I, I would be okay having two meals with rice, not three. But normally in the Philippines, it's three. Because remember I told you at 7 o'clock, there's a meal with rice, with beef, egg, whatever. And then another merienda in between. And then Rian is like 10-ish. And then at 12 o'clock, we have lunch. And then 3 o'clock is another snack for merienda. And 7 p.m. is our dinner time. And then if, if you're still awake at midnight, then you get a chance to have a midnight snack. Thank you, servers. I'll give you a tip later. Hi, Ren. Hello, sir. Hi, 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 there's never a fat person here in this table, but everyone ordered extra rice. The one cup of rice is never enough for um, one piece of chicken. <laughs> How does that feel? Fifty already. <laughs> About fifty. <laughs> well, what do you expect? It's an overlooking place, so you're supposed to. That's another fifty, I think. Fifty steps. We're taking an extra exercise today. <laughs> We've had our meals, so the extra rice is supposed to be <laughs> is supposed to be withdrawn today. <laughs> out of your body. The sweat is gonna is gonna let it out. Alay <laughs> Oh <laughs> One of the things you should know about Negros Occidental and actually the whole island is that we breed the best cockfighters in the world. Look at the river. We breed them for cockfighting. The kid, I brought the kids to. I was supposed to bring them to Duyan, but then Duyan is about 12 minutes more from here. And uh, I didn't think that it's really far. And then we re didn't really prepare our gasoline. I don't want to risk it, so we stopped over here at the Worcester Cafe. So. And it's beautiful. Oh, Ella, are you gonna start your vlog soon? 
Yeah. Cool. What are you gonna have as your on your vlog? Like lifestyle. So are you gonna have your vlog in English and Tagalog or Ilongo? Tagalog. Yes. I was told this is a lot cheaper. I mean, the food here is a lot cheaper than the, than the ones in Duyan. Like coffee in Duyan is like 70 pesos, and here is only 50 pesos, the espresso. And I have the fresh buffet. Done with our snacks. <laughs> it wasn't even one hour after our lunch, and then we had our coffee. Um, we had our merienda. Some of us had iced coffee. And then, because the space is huge, you can actually take your time, chill in this area. See, climb for the view. It's like a family picnic. I haven't introduced my other nephew, Renifel. <laughs> and his wife. Yeah, for the vlog. It's a nice Sunday picnic. <laughs> <laughs> Filipinos are crazy with pensions. <laughs> Two, three! Shhh! <laughs> 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 <laughs>